So let's talk about how we are going to identify our ECG rhythms. So here's the six step process that we are going to follow. So we're going to start with step one and we're going to identify whether the rhythm is regular or irregular. Step two, we're going to determine the heart rate to see if it falls either in our SA node or AV node or our Purkinje fibers. Step three, we're going to examine the P wave. We want to make sure that we have a P wave before every QRS complex and it has that nice upright shape. Step four, we want to measure the PR interval and the QRS complex to make sure that these are within normal. As you know, a PR interval should be between 0.12 to 0.2 seconds, and our QRS complex should be narrow and normal, less than 0.12. Step five, we want to look for anything that doesn't seem right. Do we have any early beats, missing beats, maybe beats that look a little bit different from the rest? And then once we have all of this information available to us, we are going to go to step six and we're going to interpret what that rhythm is.